for the uninitiated, the world of Bitcoin can seem abstract. Here, in a remote corner of Inner Mongolia, the cryptocurrency comes whirring to life. This mine is operated by Bitmain, a leading maker of mining chips and machines, and it's one of the largest in the world. This is really part of the central nervous system of the Bitcoin economy. There were 25,000 mining machines here, crunching the code, processing transactions, and of course, generating new Bitcoins. The machines solve complex equations to record each Bitcoin transaction to the blockchain, a decentralized ledger. In the process, miners are rewarded with Bitcoin. As each coin is mined, the difficulty increases, requiring faster processing power and more energy, something that comes cheap here in Inner Mongolia. In China, the cost to build a mining farm is very, very low. So people, when people make a decision to build a mining farm, they can do it very, very fast at a very low cost. This mine employs about 50 people and generates around a quarter of a million dollars a day in revenue. Many of the bitcoins generated here end up traded on China's cryptocurrency exchanges, some of the biggest in the world. They've come under the scrutiny of regulators, anxious about bitcoin being used to funnel money abroad. But for now, at least, the miners are being allowed to thrive. Bitmain, which claims 20,000 customers and a valuation in the billions, is laying the groundwork for a possible IPO. It's also looking to spend up to $200 million expanding in the US. I mean, the near term is about 5 to $10 million and to uh, build the first mining facility in the US. But in the long term, I think the investment in the US could expand to like 100 million or 200 million. That's a serious bet on a cryptocurrency now synonymous with wild price swings. We have to accept that if you're going to bootstrap a brand new currency from zero, um, there will be bubbles, um, there will be um, a lot of volatility on the way up to um, becoming a kind of global currency. Wu Jihan has little doubt Bitcoin's value will continue to soar. Bitcoin price going up to $100,000 is uh, quite possible. Within what time frame? Uh, like five years.